wanted to show you a relatively quick and easy, cheap way to make a kid's costumes. I use felt and I made a slinky dog today with a cute little tail. So all you're gonna need is felt, a permanent marker, a tape measure, some quick dry fabric glue, and some scissors. This is a little long on my son, but Slinky Dog tends to be longer, so you can measure from the top of the shoulder to as far down as you want covered. Underneath here, he'll wear a dark brown shirt and pants that matches his ears that I made over here. And I cut the length and I doubled it. Once you're done doubling it, I fold it in half. and I mark each side and make a hole big enough to go around their head. You can make it bigger so they can wear it longer or just leave a little extra in the back. So pretty much step by step, you just wing it. <laughs> Slinky Dog is light brown and dark brown, has a green collar and has slinky around him. So I went with silver and very kept it very simple, but everybody will know how to do slinky dog. I found some cute little ears that were dog ears, but they were light brown, so I added some dark brown felt. And that's pretty much it. I added the ties to keep it around them. It's pretty simple. Just tie it, you glue it down and it ties very well. And that'll keep it attached to your child. <laughs> um, some other things that you can do would be any character, really. I've done the seven dwarves for the kids with little hats and Jake and the Neverland Pirates. Everybody thought these were really cute, but you're gonna use a lot more glue on these, so. The length of the costume from the shoulder to the end of the fabric is 20 inches. Don't forget to double it. The tie length is 32 inches. The neck opening is six and a half inches wide and the depth of the neck plunge is three and a half inches from the center. It fits most kids size 3T to 5T. Hopefully that gives you some good ideas. Have a great night.